A patient in the U.S. is the first woman to be cured of HIV, as well as the third person ever cured of the virus. That's according to research presented at a medical conference on Tuesday. Sharon Lewin is the head of the International AIDS Society. It is exciting for the field because it's proof that a cure is possible for HIV. The patient is a middle-aged mixed-race woman who got treatment to tackle acute myeloid leukemia, a cancer that starts in the bone marrow. For that, she received a stem cell transplant. However, the donor was naturally resistant to the virus that causes AIDS. And since then, her HIV has been in remission for over a year without the need for antiretroviral therapy. She was also the first to be treated using umbilical cord blood, a newer approach that may be more accessible to a wider range of patients. Lewin, however, remains hesitant. We always are a bit cautious in this setting because this kind of intervention, a bone marrow transplant, would not be appropriate for people living with HIV. This woman received a bone marrow transplant because she also had a blood cancer that needed to be treated. The case is part of a larger study following 25 people with HIV and cancer treated with an umbilical cord stem cell transplant. The study suggests that an important element is the transplantation of HIV-resistant cells. The two prior cases of males cured of HIV also used stem cells.